At Walmart, we bought some cherry pie filling. Uh, I bought some cream cheese and butter. I bought the limited edition Great Value Cotton Candy Trail Mix. And this is creamer for our coffee and sugar, four pound bag of sugar. It used to be a five pound bag of sugar wow. years ago. Uh, we bought a six pack of Coke Zeros and then 12 of the Clear American strawberry drinks that I like. Um, this is not the kind of shampoo that I wanted, but they did not have, I like the John Frieda. It's been really, really good for my hair. They didn't have the kind that I wanted, so I bought this, and this will last until we get to Meyer. Uh, this is the Aussie. Uh, I bought some lens wipes. I use these every day for my glasses. Uh, some bowls and some uncoated paper plates. Uh, Kevin wears contacts, so he bought this Renew for his contacts. Uh, bought some Tresemme hairspray. And then dryer sheets, I just bought the cheap ones, great value for 240 sheets. It was like $7.40 something cents, really cheap. And then we bought two of the Zero Sugar Gold Peak Teas. At Walmart, we bought the Lay's IHOP Rudy Tootie Fresh and Fruity. Uh, this is strawberry top pancakes with uh, syrup and bacon. So these even, this looks like it's even shaped different. Um, then we bought the new Pillsbury Stuffed Cookie Kit. We bought the filled chocolate and the chocolate chip. Ooh, this is caramel filled. Ooh, and this is raspberry filled. I didn't even realize that. Raspberry filled, cool. Uh, we bought some whipped cream because I need that. And then we bought, uh, we found two more of these Pep's Draft House pizzas. This is the double pepperoni Doppelbach pizza and the five meat mash pizza. At Ollie's, we bought some of these Clay's candies. Uh, we bought the cinnamon, wild cherry, and peppermint. We have reviewed some Clay's candies on the channel before. We, we plan on just enjoying these. Uh, then I found also at Ollie's these Forbes candies. And I thought they would be cool to review. They're from Virginia Beach, Virginia. And I got a lot of flavors. What? Two, four, six, eight, nine flavors. I got the cotton candy, the hot cocoa, the winter, which has several in it, creamsicle, caramel apple, maple, blue raspberry, vanilla peanut butter, and watermelon. So we're looking forward to trying those. And then at Home Goods, we bought some Pop Daddy pretzels, which we have reviewed before. This is an excellent brand. These are the Mexican street corn. And then uh, I'll go into these. These are Jelly Belly Chews Taffy Candy. It's supposed to have watermelon, berry blue, butter popcorn, and berry cherry. So uh, I hope we got one of each flavor. Um, then I bought some um, flavorings. Now, a lot of people use these in their coffee, and they say, like this one is Mateo's, it says coffee syrups. I am uh, going to be using this in oatmeal because I already um, have flavored coffee. So this is for plain oatmeal, which you'll see later on in the haul, and I'm going to use these. So I'm going to try this uh, thin caramel. And this is thin English toffee. The reason it's called thin is because it's zero um, sugar. It's calorie, no calories. And then I had to buy this one. This is the Tarani. Uh, this is the sugar-free almond roca. So I love that brown and Haley almond roca anyway. And so I had to try this. Uh, this one is only five calories for two tablespoons. So I'm looking forward to that. And then in TJ Maxx, we bought the uh, Edward Mark Girl Scouts Thin Mints Bites. And then I don't really, I had just told somebody, I don't really shop at Hobby Lobby anymore. I haven't been there in probably a year. But we went there today because we've been reviewing a lot of these candy melts and I wanted to see what Hobby Lobby had to offer. So we bought, this is the Make and Mold, Sweet Collection by Make and Mold. These were the only flavors that our Hobby Lobby had. They had the birthday cake, the salted caramel, the white mint, and the dark mint. Uh, also at Hobby Lobby, we bought, uh, Kevin bought some pencils. And we bought this uh, gourmet coffee collection. So they have these cookie jar flavors. They have some Cold Stone flavors. And they have some donut shop flavors. So we will be giving those a try. And then 
at Circle K. Uh, they had these. Um, Could go back there. Oh yeah, they had these. Uh, one of these was only at Circle K. Was it the? the I think one? it was the red one. The red one. Barry Powerbomb yeah, is a like WWE or whatever. It's, it's a, a wrestling thing. It's a Circle K exclusive, but then we also bought the Ruthless Raspberry. So we'll be giving those a try. Also at Circle K, we bought some combos. We bought the nacho cheese, buffalo blue cheese, and the ranch dip. We bought the new Chex Mix Remix cheese pizza and the zesty taco. And then we also bought some Jack Link's Wild. We bought the Dr. Pepper, which is exclusive to Circle K. But then we also bought the original, the mild, and the hot. So we'll be trying all those together. Then at the Fresh Market, uh, we bought the limited edition Tate's Bake Shop. This is toasted vanilla cappuccino cookies. And Kevin bought a meal to try on his Lunch and Review channel. This is a uh, grilled chicken and bacon mac and cheese bistro, uh, bistro uh, meal. And then at Andy's Frozen Custard, this is actually the uh, cookie butter. It's cookie butter. It's Biscoff, Lotus Biscoff cookie butter. And so we'll be giving that a try. Um, then at Meyer, we bought the Blue Bunny Twist. These are frozen dairy desserts. This is a chocolate vanilla, strawberries and cream, and cookies and cream. And then we found the Ben and Jerry's. This is the new Impressively Fudged. And then I bought a John Frieda shampoo because I've been enjoying that. And then last week, in last week's haul, we got all the brew pub pizzas, lots of matzah. They were out of the sausage, so we picked up the sausage this week. This is the oatmeal I bought to use those flavorings you saw earlier. This is the oatmeal I bought. It's just plain, instant oatmeal. Uh, we bought the new Townhouse Flipsides Minis. These are house-seasoned pretzels. So pretzel on one side, cracker on the other. We bought some Trix Waffles, fruity flavors. And then we bought the Pancake Winter Berry. These were out months and months ago. We never got them. So we, we got them today. And then uh, the My Mochi. These are uh, waffle bites. We bought the Blueberry, the Original, and then these are exclusive uh, only at Meyer. So this is the Cinnamon. And then lastly, at Walmart, I bought some more of the Original Donut Shop Coffee, the Snickers, because I really like it. Uh, Mr. Beast Feastables, we bought the other flavors last week. This week, we bought the Dark Chocolate and Dark Chocolate Sea Salt. Uh, Kevin bought a sketch pad, a sketchbook to go with those pencils you saw earlier from Hobby Lobby. And I bought a dozen eggs. We went back to Walmart and I bought some of the Kellogg's Townhouse flip sides, just the original crackers. And then Kevin needed to stock up on some more tea. This is the Zero Sugar Sweet Tea from Gold Peak.